Sziasztok, üdv a HFV-n, hosszú idő után ismét Ferencváros mérkőzéssel látogatunk. Hi everyone, welcome back to HFV. It's been a long time since I covered my local club, but the day approached again. We always had a Ferencváros game at last. They are up against Florence's purple and white. Fiorentina. Conference League, Group F, match day 6, the group will come to a conclusion today. Now after Ferenc Varos won against Cukaricki in Serbia in the last round in the 98th minute, we are only a draw away from progressing. A win today would mean the first place for Ferenc Varos, a draw would mean the second place and progression as well, but if we lose and Hank win, there is a good chance we are out of Europe. Both Ferenc Varos and Fiorentina are without a defeat in this group so far and the build-up has been quite fierce to this game. The biggest reason for that is that the local rivals of Ferenc Varos are purple and white, just like today's away side, and as I heard, there is some teaming up, there will be some Uype supporters, which is the name of our local rivals, some of them will join the away support in today's game. Now, knowing all this and how much it's at stake today, I'm really hoping for a great atmosphere. Let's go. Absolutely crucial game today. It's so nice to be back at my local club because of traveling. It's been a really, really long time and it's so crucial. A win and we are first, a draw, we are second. And if we lose, we are probably out because Hank should be Chukarichki. What do you think about today? I think it's going to be a tight match, but hopefully a 31 0 win for Valens So we will claim the first place. How, how much? How many? 1 0. 1 0. I understood 31. <laughs> I think it will be an exciting game, 2-1 uh, for us, and we will uh, score the winner goal in the 89th minute. Varga is back, our absolutely crucial striker, will he score? Yes, he will score for sure. One goal, so the other goal will be from Zakarias. And Fiorentina in dark purple, our rival colors as I told you in the intro. Get the ball on the way. This absolutely crucial game, which uh, was supposed to be full house, yeah. and it doesn't quite look like that so far. But uh, we really hope that the remaining seats will fill up.
section is really just chanting against the eternal rivals as if it will be a derby or something. Ooh. happened so far but now in, at the end of 34th minute we almost got the lead two insane chances and look at what effect it has on the atmosphere it's much better straight away because it hasn't been that good so far come on There is really not too much to say about this first half. It doesn't feel like it's the most important game of the group for both teams, like, at all. And uh, it really confuses me because uh, not even the atmosphere, not, not the game, it's really strange. Like, my friend next to me said, almost as if it would be a friendly or something. Expecting much more, hoping for a much better second half. Must say, even though I didn't vlog that game against uh, Hank, which was 1-1 one, one here in this stadium, in that game, it was a hundred times better atmosphere, so hoping for something similar in the second half. I really hope we can grab at least a goal in the second half, because then we would have a much bigger chance for a draw as well, and maybe a win. But neither of us sides look too motivated so far. Let's see about the second half. Fifth minute, we could have easily considered the equalizer. The header after the corner just passed the post, so uh, we were really lucky with this one. Seventy-third minute, one-one after the corner. Really weak defending. I hope we're not about to give this away because 
hand card in front, so we can't concede more if not scoring really. Um, I didn't see this coming, but they were somewhat superior. You can always concede one goal, it's always in the game. I hope the lads will sharpen up in these last 17 minutes plus additional time. Two springs on the European stage consecutively. Europa League last year. We finished second behind Fiorentina in this group after two wins, four draws, and Hank, despite winning against Chukaricki, finished third. The draw means second place and playoffs for Ferenc Varos, known as round of 24 as well of Conference League and we'll face one of the third place teams of the Europa League group stages there. Congrats to Fiorentina for winning the group, we'll take the second place because we had the finalists of the previous Conference League season in our group after all. It was a pretty strong group, I mean you could have this in the Europa League as well easily. If you like the content join me on the channel's social media or possibilities on screen. I'm hoping to see you soon, I was HFV, take care. Hoi Rafferty.